Understanding the phrase, direct the course. Hello, everyone. Welcome back to our English language learning series. Today, we're diving into a fascinating phrase, direct the course. This phrase is not just about navigation, but also about taking control and steering things in the desired direction. Whether you're a beginner or advanced learner, understanding such phrases is key to mastering the English language. So, let's get started. Direct the course is a phrase that combines two words, direct and course. Direct here means to control or guide something. It implies intentionality and purpose. On the other hand, course refers to a path or direction that something or someone is following. When combined, these words convey the idea of actively guiding or controlling a path or direction. This can be literal, like steering a ship, or metaphorical, like guiding a project. To better understand, direct the course, let's see it in action. 1. In business, the CEO directed the course of the company through the economic crisis. 2. In personal life, after much thought, she decided to direct the course of her career towards arts. 3. In navigation, the captain directed the course of the ship away from the storm. These examples show how the phrase can be applied in various scenarios emphasizing the control and guidance aspects. When using, direct the course, remember, it's often used in a figurative sense. Don't confuse it with literal navigation unless the context calls for it. It implies active involvement. It's not about letting things happen on their own. Understanding synonyms can broaden your usage. Here are a few, steer the ship, guide the way, lead the charge. These phrases carry similar meanings but can add variety to your speech or writing. And that's a wrap on, direct the course. Remember, it's all about taking control and guiding the direction in various aspects of life. We hope this video has illuminated this phrase for you. Keep practicing, and soon you'll be using English phrases like a pro. See you in the next video.